All right, this thing does not look easy at all. This kit has a lot of parts, a lot of parts, a lot of bolts, a lot of screws. So there's nothing here. Welcome to my channel. So this car, this car doesn't have none of this stuff. Like it doesn't come from factory. It doesn't come with it. All right. So let me uh, let me go outside and show you. Just put a brand new engine in. Voila. 440, baby. I get around the lift. Got some aluminum radiator as well. All right, let's turn them on to see how it sounds. I got a change. I got a new. Uh, People gonna be like, <laughs> that doesn't look like a full food, right? They're gonna get full. Alright, let me uh, turn it on, see how it sounds.
want to get in on the lift. Janta. Uh, What's up, Jacob? <laughs> all right this thing does not look easy at all this kit has a lot of parts a lot of parts a lot of bolts a lot of screw so there's nothing here so i still got to figure out where i'm gonna bolt that stuff and instructions say i gotta drill a hole Come to the front. The front. Yeah. I don't see nowhere to put it on, but we're gonna figure out where. Look, this is missing a cover. Just suspension. All right, all right. Transmission is this. I look fresh. Fresh, fresh, fresh. All right, this. This is the progress we got so far. So, you're gonna have one hole. Of course, everybody got one hole. <laughs> so right there. Now, you line them up right there like that. So you can mark it. So you know where the other hole is. Right there. Half inch. Make sure it's half inch so you don't have no play. Drop it like it's hard. Drop it like it's hard. Then you stick it in that hole right there. Like that. 
You might have to play with it a little bit. Take it out again. Just make it a little bigger. Creo que había que meterlo antes ese. Okay. No va a topar. Uh -huh. Va a topar el mofle. ¿Quiere que lo deje por dentro? Sí, hay que meterlo por dentro. Hay que, hay que quitarlo. Pero anyways, no va a entrar. Oh, yeah, yeah, drop it down. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And we put it in first. Right there. Yeah. So it's gotta go on the inside, so you gotta do this first. Put it in there. Put it, in there. And then put it back in there. And you should have enough space on the back to torque it. Not this one. The other one. You should still have enough space to like access to it. There you go. Mm -hmm. And then you put the nut on the outside. Everything. And then this yeah. one, make sure you go under the brake line right here. Same thing on the other side. There's a brake line on the back. We gotta go under here. You got it above. We gotta go under. Nope. <laughs> want to make sure you tie both sides before you do anything else with 16 millimeters make sure they're tight now we gotta put the sway bar in it okay, but that's oh, we gotta tie those ones first but we gotta locate where exactly where is it gonna be That's about right, right there. So let me get a tape measure. So we measure off here to here the same. Same thing on that. That one's going on. And that is the one. Hmm? Okay. 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 So let's do that. Let's do uh, six yeah, inches. Like. Okay, let's move outside. So let's do seven. Seven, seven. Seven inches. Seven inches from the inside, touching the ball right here. Thank 
torcido. Ve como este está muy, muy largo porque está torcido. Mm -hmm. It's good. Same thing here. Seven. Three. Seven. Close a little bit. Seven, exactly. Put it straight, yep. ¿O será que es esta misma? <laughs> ¿Sí? Ok, take it out. Take it out. Pero sigue grabando y ahora quedamos como tontos. No, we just testing. <laughs> now we got the mark where it goes. We know exactly where it goes now. No salió ese. Ay, no. No quiero que salga. Todavía. Oh. Now that you know where it goes, seven no, inches. Tiene, 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 tiene. <laughs> then you put the bushing in. Okay, ahora aquí el otro. Ese se movió mucho. Se movió mucho ese. Este le falta. Está en 6 pulgadas. Ese está como a 10. Seven right there. Move it. All right. Or maybe no there. Seven. Maybe a mass. Eight. Move to eight. Eight, eight. Right. Right there. And this is 
eight right here. So eight and eight. Check this again. Check the tape for the center. Seven to the bottom. Eight. Right there. Eight. Whoop, whoop. Eight, eight. No voy a apretar mucho todavía para que gire. Sí, hasta que ya lo pongamos aquí. Necesita que uno más largo. O sabe qué? Tiene que esto tiene que ir detrás, creo. Tiene tres, tres oh. Tú me la empujas y yo te la meto. Va, 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 este va a controlar este carro, esta cosa, loco. Este carro no tiene soy, va. Lo tengo. Tú me dices. It's a little tough to put them in, but that's because he's never had a soy bar, so. Tell him, tell him. <laughs> Look at them when you talk to them, man. <laughs> I'm gonna charge you for, for every video. <laughs> Don't talk about money, man. 100,000 a month. People might get scared. <laughs> This, this is gonna help a lot, this. No, 16. 16. So these are 19s. 19s. 16s. 16. Milwaukee power. This car is going to be stiff now. Just look at that. As of right now, the soy bar is touching this. The chalks, but once it goes down, it's, it's gonna lower. It's barely touching right there. But once it goes down, that's gonna, it's gonna get away. Now to the front. For the front, right next to your wheel, you're gonna find a little hole right there. That's where this one is gonna go. A sway bar link in. Then you're gonna see two mini holes over here, which you gotta pre-drill, make it bigger. That one right there and that one. 
And then that bracket is gonna go sideways like that. One bolt on the back. As so you can see, this one's gonna be empty. And then one bolt on the front, and the back one is gonna be empty. So it's gonna be cross, just like that. So we still gotta grease everything and put the other bush in here, this one and tight everything. Now, before you tie all this bolt, the car gotta be either on ramps or on a uh, alignment jack or scissor lift, but the tire gotta be flat, I mean, on the floor. The car cannot be on the air, if you get what I'm saying. So just make sure you read the instructions but that's what it it's says. It's not gonna let you put the soy bar link in it if it's on the air. Mm -hmm. We're just doing it this way because it's easier. Yeah, so we're not gonna tie anything. We're just gonna, you know, put it in, put the tie back on, put it on on the lift and lift it up on the front and then get everything tight. Because we need the weight of the car to be on this. All this. Now the kid didn't come with this bolt because the instruction is assuming that you already have this on your car. But this one didn't have it, so we had to provide our own bolt for both sides. All right, I'm gonna show you something you don't know about a 1969 Roadrunner. All right, rear driver wheel, the lock nut, or thread it backward. So you gotta go to the front to put it in. So it's an eight um, hex head and a 15 millimeter on top, or you can just use an eight Allen if you have an Allen Allen key. Looking good. This is another level. Ready for the car show.
We got one side done. 440. So either way, to replace them, you gotta drop this whole thing down. This whole uh, this thing suck air through here to bring it inside the car for the vent. All right, so this one you can do it without removing the whole breeder like this one, but this one you can't because one of the bolts is right behind, right behind this bracket right here. So that's why I had to remove it. And this thing you gotta bolt, this is metal. This is very, very heavy. You gotta bolt it from the back. So I'm gonna put that one on. That's how it look. All right, so remember the old one, 383. Since now we got a new engine. Good, good, good. All right, let me continue. All right, so I got the other one done. That one done. So now I just gotta put this thing back.